Hello everybody and welcome to Hitman, or back to Hitman 2. We only got a couple missions left. New York and Haven Island. First, New York. Golden Handshake. Don't know if I'll be able to do both of these in this one. I do want to get a good grip of... Why did it give me that title screen? Three families. That's all it took. Tell us everything about them. The ivory towers are about to fall. And when we're done... Let's cross that bridge when we get to it. For now, the partners are all that matter. There's an issue. Of course there is. Olivia's tracked the names mentioned by the Constant, and they're dead ends. How dead? Obituaries for all three have appeared online. Accidental death, heart failure, lung cancer. They're covering their tracks. How many times is this old lady gonna die? A contingency plan of sorts. The Constant wasn't aware of it. Well, it seems they didn't tell him everything after all. Something this big will leave traces behind. The Constant says to follow the money. Milton Fitzpatrick. The investment bank. It's a key Providence asset. Which you work for. The director of the New York branch is a Providence operative. It's our best bet as a way in. I'll tell the pilot to turn the plane around. Right, gentlemen. Here's what we've come up with. The partners are transitioning between identities. But everything is so recent, the Milton Fitzpatrick bank records will still be intact. We've confirmed that the partners have active accounts there. However, the bank's records are remotely updated on a frequent basis. We may only have hours before any leads that could get us the new identities of the partners are gone forever. The data we need can be obtained in two ways. The bank's data core can be accessed through the basement vault, but getting inside the vault could be challenging. Alternatively, bank director Athena Savalas, head of security Mateo Perez, and head of accounts Fabian Mann each carry a partial backup drive of data. We'll need all three drives to get the full data. Now, we cannot risk the partners discovering the data breach. Eliminating the bank's director, Athena Savalas, would sever the last remaining Providence tied to the bank and keep our activities hidden. Okay, one more time. We break into the vault, extract the hard drive rack, and eliminate the director on the way out. Wow, only one target? We. You. Good luck, yeah. 47. That's what I thought. I'm always by myself. Alright. It's like a heist mission. Okay. Uh, swap that for lockpick. Want the cooler looking gun. Whoa, when did I get this? I'll take it. Uh, don't think I have any starting or drop off, so let's go. Why oh, am I on casual? I was doing challenges. Hang on. <laughs> there we go. Welcome to New York, 47. The Milton Fitzpatrick Bank is open for business, but it seems there's some sort of investigation underway. Expect increased security. Your target, Director Athena Savalas, can be found in her top floor office, overlooking the iconic Teller Hall. Head of security, Mateo Perez, is roaming between the vault area and the Teller Hall, talking to employees. And head of accounts, Fabian Mann, can be found on the investment banker floor and the top floor of the bank, driving the internal investigation. 
So there's probably challenges with all Remember, these people, but I don't have to, to kill them for the mission. Reinforced vault, or alternatively, acquire three hard drives carried by the director and her two lieutenants, Man and Perez. Good luck, forty-seven. Oh, so I could just take the, all them out instead of going into the vault. But the vault sounds cool. How big is this place? It seems like a very small map. Yeah. Yeah, wow, this is very small. I thought it'd be like a... You kind of think like there'd be back alleys or like a small segment of the town, like, in here, but no. Okay. I just want to see how many mission stories there are. Like five? All right, so first run, blind run. Going to be looking around. Not really going to use this mode either. Hello. Uh, excuse me, please. I need some alone time. Oh. <laughs> okay. Are these robbers? They're gonna rob the bank. Uh, you're not supposed to be here, so would you mind just? Hey, <laughs> hey man. Uh, man, you read me. Shit. Like was in a lot I just wanted to see what the disguise was. <laughs> oh, you probably heard the crowbar. Okay, uh, they don't know what I look like. What's a Dax? Oh, it's a submachine gun. Okay, get out of here. What about doing your job? You don't know it was me. They're bank robbers. Don't let them out. Don't let them off easy. She's knocking people out. Security check. Hey, you. Where do you think you're going? Oh, sorry. Didn't get a good look at him. Yeah, damn right you didn't. Oh. What is this? Whoa. That cuts out audio? This is some futuristic tech I need. Maybe I should have taken that security guards off or disguise. I don't know what you're talking about. My name's Tina. Tina Smith? I work in insurance. Right. Undercover, are we? No, no, I'm just not who you think I am, sir. Now, please leave me alone or I'll be forced to alert security. Oh, I'm I'm sorry. Uh, it's just you really look like her. Um, well, have a good day. Who is this? Ruby Red, famous muckraking investigative journalist, is in the bank. Known for her fierce skills at digging up dirt and her excellent nose for scandal, she's definitely up to something. Might be worth following her around the bank, 47. Do I have to follow her? Okay. Probably say a distance away. Is this a real bank? I don't know. Are all these places in the Hitman game real? I'm at the bank now. Uh, it's obviously rare areas like America, Bangkok, Marrakesh. Thailand. Or are they like real areas like this? Or like the hotel? Or the Isle of Scale? Or the racetrack in Miami? I don't know. Who's going down? Ruby Red, a famous investigative reporter, is hanging out in the bank waiting for someone to deliver documents I could... Apparently caused great harm to Milton Fitzpatrick and, in particular, director Athena Salvaos. Of course the stock will plummet. I expect that will happen immediately. That's the point, right? Show the yep. world the ugly side of this whole business. We're doing this. I'll email you the documents. I mean, I did you guys a favor by taking them out. Investigate the whistleblower. Are you the whistleblower? Oh, she overheard. Nice haircut. Classic, but this is restricted. Move along. Can I overhear her? Yes, Shit. 
don't really give you that much uh, leeway here. Hopefully this doesn't fail the mission just because I can't follow her. Hi there. Oh, am I allowed in here? Sir, sir, you should oh. go back the way you came. Sorry. You get into trouble. I'm glad we speak the same language. She said earlier, hey, I gotta touch you. Step up your game. Fuck. I need a change. Fuck it. Oh, right, no one saw. Okay, I need a new disguise, pronto. This has been ruined since like two seconds in. Yeah, I need this. I can't have you giving me away. Same silent assassin, I can tell you that. Hopefully no one just comes in here, right? Okay. Uh oh wow, should I someone just investigate her? Uh, wait, did I go the wrong way? Oh, I can go that way. These cops are good at their job. They recognize I'm not one of them. She has been up there a long time. I'm surprised she has, like, moved on from the quest. I need your advice. You did well. For Remember that, that situation at work I was talking about? The bank cooled ten well, million, and I hit. Does he even know yet? From what I heard, Ada we kind of want to be times. left alone. Do you mind? Who's we? So that's why he's fired. Yep. Wow. Teresa is me. There was it. One of the bankers is facing termination. Apparently, his choice of attire isn't in line with the standards of the bank, and the director decided he must go. Definitely an outfit I could take. Remember that situation at work I was talking about? Well, I hit a bit of an obstacle. No, nobody's discovered anything, but for some reason, security is super high today. I, I don't think I can get to the document safely. There's some sort of investigation going on, and they're specifically looking for the file. No, I hid the file in a safety deposit box in the basement. Keys with me here on my desk. Hell, I can even see the journalist from here, but... <sighs> this whistleblowing thing sounds great on paper, but I am telling you, it's pretty you're... damn terrifying when you're the one doing it. Where's your desk? Yes, okay. I know it's important, but I can't risk my job. Was she supposed to be talking out from here? That was weird. All right, I gotta get over there without being seen. Fuck. Get behind the glass wall. Uh, okay, which one was her desk? Uh... Pamphlet. Okay. Uh, I imagine it's not someone with at the desk already. No. Oh. Why was it in the garbage? All right, downstairs. It's next to one that's slightly open. Let's 
What's up, boys? Looking good today, sir. Thank you. I'm really sorry, but we've had to section off this area for now. Well, at least it's not as bad as that time in yeah. Queens. Remember that? Oh, the six thousand semi incinerated files we had to take to get. A pile of papers containing a slew of incriminating evidence suggesting that Director Savalas, the head of the Count's Fabian Mann, have been acting recklessly with the bank's money. The information could severely damage the bank's reputation if it got released to the wild. Remind me. Yeah. I'm not taking any chances by letting you in. But he's not here now. Sorry, not on my watch. All right, Miss Red. Here are your documents. Is that what I think it is? I'm not holding anything. Yes. Just make sure the information will be put to good use. Oh, you can bank on that. Who are you? What's your role in this? I'm not important. Good luck. It sounds like Miss Red has quite a scoop on her hands. My guess is this will cause a major market upset, which is sure to bring the director out from her fortified office. Okay, I was really wondering how this was going to help take her out. Uh, since I got access, let me go down there and see if I can get the data core. This is the vault, 47. The data core should be behind that large steel door. Anyone got a key card? Hmm. Uh. Okay. Now, while you're looking, I don't know if it actually matters with the, uh, if the camera sees you do it. Probably does. Because there's people watching it. IT note. A notice from the bank's head of security mentions that the building suffers from unstable Wi Fi. If the connection fails, IT have full access to the director's office and computer. Hmm. Sounds useful, 47. Okay, sabotage the Wi-Fi. Wonder what they're playing. Chandler key. Yeah, the stock has crashed. <gasps> Chase Burger. Soda. Do do do. Intercept an IT guy and disguise yourself as him. I mean, I could just take them both out. I realized I had two cans. I'll just take you and hide you. Where's uh she at? You coming down? All right, I am IT. In access to the director's office. What's in here? Like old files and stuff. Oh. Ah. It's probably a way to get that outfit. I mean, I'm going up there, but isn't she coming down? She's still up there. I don't know what she's doing. How do I get up there? Believe it. I hit every quarter they threw at me. Oh, that's the guy. How, how could she do this? Can't be fired. There's still another floor? What's in here? Oh, sorry.
Not allowed in here. Okay. Oh, wait, am I? Why was that illegal? I might see. I can go anywhere. Director needs me. Oh, she's going down. Hello? Sir? What you got there? Security keycard. Uh, can you help me out here, buddy? I'm taking your bust. Am I supposed to follow her? P probably. I mean, all this did was get her out of the office. I don't know if... I'm supposed to lead to somewhere private. That's Fabian Mann, head oh, there of she is. at this branch of Milton Fitzpatrick. If she goes she back up, they'll probably the start to trigger that guy. That is Athena Savalas, billionaire banker, Providence Herald, and Bane of the middle class. Alright, let me try this again. You are slow, lady. There are so many cameras here. But it is a bank, so I get it. Investment banker. It's on the other side of this. So like a one-way mirror? Cronkite report? Cronkite? Don't I have the key card? Okay, let me see if this works now. Hello. Are, are you signaling to me or is it? What's back here? Boom, I'm in. Him. Him. Yeah, tokens. I mean, I could just take her out right now. It's like, what, three guards here? I don't think I've saved that all. Uh, how should we get you? Get your knife. Boom. Director Savalas eliminated. Good work, forty-seven. Who found it? Oh. It's back here. One way mirror. Yeah, here's the stuff. Earphones. Okay, so I can choke people out. Anybody copy? No sign of any pups. Moving on. Why are you suspicious of me? I was just standing here. Maybe they recognize me. We gotta find the punk. Search the area. Yes. Oh wait, she's one of the data discs. Yeah, who are you gonna put in lockdown? Target's already dead, idiots. I toss you. Oh, that's not a thing. Here we go. Okay, I'm just gonna try and get. To Wait, did I not pick it up? Is that it? Hey, get ready. 
I'm ready. The first Got it. Data disk secured. Two more to locate. Uh, I'll go for the data core. Not the backups. Nothing at my position. Hopefully this is hopefully this disguise is allowed down to the basement. Is there even any I can do? No, there is one. I guess that's getting to down to the core. Who are you? Oh, are you the head of stuff? You gonna tell me who he is? Diana? Okay, I guess not. Please let me be allowed in here. Coolio. Damn it. Turn the AC on, we'll just knock them all out. Ah, yeah, chloroform. Can I make it worse somehow? Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I gave him a tour and everything. Afterward, we went to this little diner over on 5th, and he told me the strangest thing. Though he's a Freemason, and a member of a local lodge since I was a little kid. And he told me that Milton Fitzpatrick serves more Masonic members than any other bank in the U.S. Is that right? That's why for the vault. Like a coincidence. I mean, it's a big investment bank with just... Wait, if she didn't have it, who has it? including... Okay, I kind of want free reign in here, so. Said it was rumored that the bank was actually being run by some super secret group, you know, like the Illuminati or something. Really? Okay. <laughs> They're fucking deaf. Master key. What's in here? Ah, oh, the vault key card. Duh. Um, might as well take that guy out. And you saw my face. Press the button. Ocean's 47. Triple layer? Oh. Great work, 47. You now have access to the vault. Okay, I thought I was gonna have to like somehow dodge all that shit. Okay, I just wanna see what's around here. Violin. I can just hide that. Okay. I'll be knife. Another token. Burial dagger. Another bust. Imperial eggs. Why? Why is it always illegal to take those? Oh, I'm gonna be rich. I can actually take money. Although he's just gonna use these to knock people out. Is that it? Yep. Seven gold bars. Good work, 47. That's the evidence secured for now. Okay. Careful not to lose it. If anyone sees you with that rack, my guess is you'll draw a lot of unwanted attention to yourself. Shit, how do we get out of here then? The last objective completed. Exfiltrate the bank, 47. Miss Hall will want to have a close look at that. Yeah, uh, you probably want to go this way. I don't know how to get out that way. Hmm. 
Let me just see if either of these guys have it. Got a uh, thing on you? It doesn't look like it. Oh, man. Alright, guess I gotta go upstairs. So I literally have to sneak out. Why does it keep saying miss? Is it because I keep dropping it? That's closest. Should I just hightail it? Yeah, I know I missed story missions. Stop telling me. I'm just gonna bolt. <laughs> I'm compromised. No, no. Go, go, run. <laughs> These are the worst guards ever. I didn't even get shot. See ya. <laughs> really? That's it? That was quick. Break the bank. This is a very small map. I got like a third of the challenges already. <laughs> All right. Uh, flash device, gold bar. Okay. Olivia has found something interesting. I'll tell you on the way. Where are we going? To Paradise 47. Do you have two tickets? Are we supposed to be on that plane? <laughs> to be continued. Wait, what? There's still another mission. What the hell are you talking about? Unless. Is the last mission like a bonus mission? Isn't that paradise? I don't know. Okay, let's do that again. Do the story missions, hopefully they work. I'm gonna start with the IT one just to make sure. And I'll bring in... I don't know. Uh. I bring this in. Yeah. Okay. And I'm just gonna follow them. Yeah, start with this one. See if it actually works this time. How can I get down? Oh, stairs right here. Nope, those are up. Maybe you shouldn't wear that very colorful jacket to work. Does this just do anything? Does that like cause people to trip? That's a takedown? He's dead? No, he's knocked out. Oh, come on. How does every guy know the janitor here? Even this guy. These are amazing security guards. Okay, turn off. Was it because she wasn't up there? Is that what fucked it up? I don't care. I want this guy's close this time. Why do you have just a perfect good cheeseburger just sitting out? 
Really? No porn? That's not believable. Who's calling? There's so many soda here. Fizz. Dr. Pop. Isn't that for this one? From the banks headed yeah. Anything else down here? A tranquilizer. Hi, Roy. It's Tim, Director Savalas' PA. Listen, I hate to disturb you, but the director wants one of you to come up and look at her machine. So ah, that's who was calling. Uh, as soon as you can, please. Where's the phone? Or the speaker, anyway? Oh. No, that's tinfoil. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, yeah, sure thing, boss. Coming right up. Wait, is he still knocked out? <laughs> okay, he's not turned around. <laughs> Now you can say bitch, it's okay. Uh how do you expect me to go up there? Oh, isn't there a staircase this way? Probably gonna have to frisk me. I remember where I got the key card. Aw, oh, tranquilizer. They're definitely gonna see this. Okay, so got my soda cans. Who wants to touch me? Feel those muscles. Does he? Monetary? Looks like a space invader. I Finally, you work. Problem solving skills. I'm known to be the best. <laughs> you better be. The director's a, a handful. Don't talk to her, all right? Wasn't planning on it. Can I actually do my job and fix the computer? Where is she? Oh, she's watching her people in there. Okay. Uh, investigate this. Move calendar meeting. What did that just do? Scanning through director's cal daily calendar, it becomes, it becomes clear that she has a meeting planned with Fabian Nan and Mato Perez, scheduled around the end of the business. Around end of business, but should be possible to advance it if needed. Okay. So I should follow all of them then. Can I get a drink while I'm here? Not like just poison or a missing vodka bottle. Can I go here? Hello. Hi. I could see you in there. Go check your computer. Oh, that's a place, not blend in. Don't worry, I'm just IT. I'm just looking around. You guys got good pizza here. Freedom pizza. Look at it. Oh, it looks so good. I'm so hungry. I got four Dr. Pops. No, three. What is that file? <sighs> Anyone need help? I'm IT. So is she not going to check it until I go back down? There she goes. I probably can't go back in there. Look 
Please check your computer. Where are you going? Leave the room now. Oh, the meeting started. Oh, she's doing it for me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm leaving. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, 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 sorry. Mateo, go back in there. I think your name is Mateo. Or your man. Can I go in here? Yeah. Where are we in this? Give me an update. I can't kill them from in here, can I? I probably sh uh, no, I don't have a gun. I could just go through that door. Why is that door open? For. Nothing is locked on the internal security system. Nothing happened here. The uh -huh. deposit boxes were clearly accessed, and files were looked through up here and up. Mm -hmm. Well, back to my usual boring existence. You're not allowed to. That's a good boy. No offense. I was trying to close the door for you, buddy. I want to kill them all and get the backup discs. There we go. <laughs> okay. I might have broken their dialogue, so let's just do this. What can I use? The wrench? Soda? Let's use all soda. What do we got? Fizz? Let's fizz them up. Get in here. Okay, all good. I'll take back up. Snap your neck. Security key, disc. Simple as that. That's Don't even need to go get the thing. Two more to locate. Second backup data disk. <laughs> there we got all of them. Just one to go, 47. Direct uh, oh, let's leave eliminated. that way. Good work, 47. Where is What is this? Oh, letter opener. I thought it was like a document. Okay. I don't even really need to exit. I could just restart. Let's see if I unlocked anything for mastery. Okay, a few things. Want to get one mastery point? And a couple. Okay. Got two more challenges. Oh, I could be a bank teller. <laughs> you could just start as the robber. Okay, keep all that stuff.
How did I get here? Did I apply for a job, work here for a week, and then now I'm here? Probably. I haven't even been here yet. Okay, uh... The heist. Okay, let's do hostile termination. Gotta go up there? Hopefully I'm allowed up there. You my boss? I am not. Oh boy. IT is allowed anywhere, but I'm not allowed here. So are we just supposed to let anyone from IT in there? That's right. You know how crap this old building is with the wireless and now the drone. Dr. Hate's seen cables anywhere? Oh, she had a router installed in her office. Watch out! Yeah, don't care. Let's see if I can hide them back here. Oh, someone's coming anyway. I'm only doing that so I can get the chameleon partially unlocked. No, they're not coming in anyway. Okay, please don't see me drag them. Fuck, who? What are you doing with that body? I think I just fucked it up. Yeah, boy. I'm gonna quickly go over here. What's the story mission? Please tell me. This doesn't look good. Letter of termination. Sky yourself as a fired banker. Got it. Lady, why'd you give me away? I understand. Uh oh. Come on, we're not gonna lose this guy. Run away. Run away. This is not going well. That fucking camera gave me away. I can't believe it. I hit every corner. Quickly, quickly. Okay. Uh, approach the director's assistant. Woo! The sweater. This is a sweater. Hey, sir, I have a question. I Shut up. You leave the vicinity. Hey. Stop right there. Hey, good numbers last week. Well, don't gotta get frisked. Assistant, you have to let me in there. Hi, can you let me in? Okay, I'll wait for things to calm down. No, all good now. I'm here for a meeting with Director Savalas. I don't think it. Oh, yes, of course. That's you right. recognize the sweater, huh? Thank you. Excellent, forty-seven. This should be a termination. Director Savalas won't forget. Director? She coming out? I'll just wait here. These guys are on high alert. Oh, there they go. Here she comes. Come on, do you read? Someone Target lockdown. Come on. Wait, <laughs> Athena. Oh, man. Okay, I did. I don't know, but there's probably something cool to kill her, like pushing out the clock window. Can you do that? Is that a challenge? Yeah. Okay, we don't need to see it. We know what will happen. Fuck this. Uh, and fuck the bank teller disguise. It sucks. Wish I could start as IT. Anyways, we know how that will play out, so I'm not going to do it again. 
Uh, the heist. Oh yeah, shit, how do I get down? This guy's gonna see me, whatever. Yes, I am. Well, you should. Shut up. This is the vault, 47. The data core should be behind that large steel door. I gotta get in there somehow. Is there a way in? Uh, There's a staircase over there. Fuck okay, let's go that way. Wait, was there a keycard in the IT room? Yeah, nothing over there. I have a key. Not a key card. Wait, security lock? Cool. Oh, shit. Wait, what does this do? Oh, can I drop it in here? I know what you're thinking, 47. <laughs> you won't fit. I could probably drop the briefcase down there. The vault looks even more fortified than we feared. Oh, if what? I'm not mistaken, only high tier security is allowed in here. Oh, damn it. Is that because I, uh, let's restart. Why did it reset or quit? Sorry, do I know you? Sure you do. My name's Tim. Do you not know Tim? Tim the ball guy. Duh. We've met. We've had coffee. I know you. Okay, well, at least I know I, how I can get in there. This is the vault. For we can't really go anywhere. The data core should be behind that large steel door. I'd probably go in that room. Okay, what's the mission story? What is it? Oh, I missed it again. What? What is the story mission? That important, but you can expect a big no. Great. Thanks for nothing. Let me get... Maybe I just have to go in as plain as normal? Is it like literally shooting your way down there? You're giving me like the worst location possible. Why are you starting me there when I just when if I walk in I fail? Makes no sense. I'm looking this up. Hey, how are you? Shut up. What's this map even called? <laughs> uh Golden Handshake? Uh, let's 
So you have to just wait for Diana to keep talking. Okay, well, I'm going back as the, uh... No. Janitor again. I also go grab those electric key cards because I might probably be easier. I might be able to open the vault, that door that way. This is a very confusing mission. Oh, have we talked to everyone? No, I think I saw him going to the bathroom. I am too, too determined to get this mission out before I start another one. Alright. Are they going to frisk me if I go down there? Hopefully not. Also, it was a nice save point, so I'll have to go back there again. Get the these things. Oh, okay. This is the vault. I'm really sorry, but we've had the data core should be behind that large steel door. That yeah, does work. Okay, now. Hmm. The vault looks even more fortified than we feared. If I'm not mistaken, only high tier security is allowed in here. Access seems to be restricted to the use of a key card of some sort. Hang on. There's a there we go. security hub on the second floor. You might be able to acquire what you need there. Uh, sure, he said all that. Disguise yourself as high security guard. I mean, I already unlocked the door. What else do I need? That's a very stupid mission. They should just have you... Walk there and instantly say, like, mission revealing. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, I'm running for it. Excuse me, sir. I'm afraid that this area is not. That worked. Nope. Janitors aren't allowed up here? What? Why? Uh, do they have the th stained. Shit, how am I supposed to do this? I could probably poison him. I could probably... Did I throw these? No. Oh, there's another one here too. Don't come over here. Okay. Just leave that hanging around? I don't remember where the poison is. Uh, I want to make sure this guy goes for it. Stop looking. Oh shit. Go see what that was. Affirmative. Hey you. Stop. Fuck. Uh Why does that keep happening? What the fuck? Okay, I'm resetting. I'm just gonna restart the mission. Fuck. How do you, how do you have corrupted saves? That makes no sense. It sucks now is I have to make sure I don't screw up that story mission again. Should I just skip it? No. Here's what I'll do first. I'll make sure I'll get one of those outfits, then go down. 
And I'll make sure I start with the key card so I don't have to go over and get it. Let's put something else in there. Or nothing at all. Uh, janitor. Okay. Get one of those high security guards first. They threw at me. How the I think you're allowed up there. Is there poison in here? No, it's probably another closet. Be really great if I can use those that, like tinted glass. I can't have you fucking my stuff up. I haven't been you yet. Okay. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, no, no, no. Hiya! Did you see a man with a tie on his shoulder coming after you? Okay. Got all this. Start the story mission. Shit, where are these? Uh, did he have one on him? No. Maybe there's one upstairs. Please work this safe. Newspaper. Uh, any key cards? Your phones. Have you seen Savalas down here recently? She never comes down. She prefers to look over all of us from that watchtower of hers. I mean, do I need one? I have the key card reader. God damn it! And so, Maddie, any news on your end? My squad. So are we just supposed to let any? What's up, boys? There's one on the guy's desk. I know that, but I don't know if I could take it. Uh, I don't think there's any in here. Oh, I could just take it. All right, enter the vault area. I probably didn't even have to do this. I probably just could have went straight to the vault. I just want to make sure I'm actually doing this one right before it fucks up again. No, oh, no, that's the wrong way. Data of yours. I mean, wow. 
This is the vault. I'm really sorry, but we've had to... The data core should be behind that large steel door. <gasps> okay. Excellent, 47. Now all that remains is to get inside the vault really? itself. That's that's the stupidest fucking mission ever when you can just easily walk in there. All right, let's go see what this one is. Now, poor guy. He did well for us. I mean, he closed the Berman account. Oh, have we talked to everyone? No, I think I saw him go into the bathrooms. He's been there for ages. Okay. Milton Fitzpatrick is holding a round of job interviews. The final applicant was last seen going into the bathrooms where he's been for some time. Nerves, maybe? Doesn't sound promising. Disguise yourself as the job applicant. Seriously, buying it yourself? Or you're in here by yourself? Okay. Ready for the interview? Don't worry, I'll go for you. Oh. <laughs> Don't look in the bathroom. I only need one more disguise. Who could that be? I don't know. Hello, I am ready for my interview. Please don't ask to frisk me. Should I let HR know you're ready for the final interview? Yes. I feel like a new man. I'm ready. Wonderful. Follow me, please. It's right down here. Best of luck in your interview, 47. Let's see where this will lead you to. That's it. I'll see how this plays out. Don't worry. You'll do fine. Was this just to get in here? Thank you. Mr. Thomas. I found it every location. I'm Kevin, and this is Melissa. Or these. With HR, and we will be guiding you through this last test. It's important to stress that there's no pass or fail here. It's merely a standard personality test meant to gauge how you'll fit into our corporate culture. All right. If you're ready, let's kick this off, okay? I'm ready. Okay, so this is a very simple test. All you do is pick a card and tell us what you see there. Now, it's important to point out that there are no right or wrong answers here. It's just to give us a better impression of I mean that's 47 on the left. Does that make sense? It's yes, with two right. guns. All right, Mr. Thomas, uh, let's proceed then. If you will, please pick the card that most conjures up the word opportunity. I'll pick this one. Good choice. Tell me, what is the first thing you see here? Just the very first thing that comes to mind. I see a figure in a large coat. Perspective skewed, as if I'm looking at him from the ground. He's got something in his hands. I, uh, go on. He's on. Dual firearm. Large caliber pistols. I see. What else do you see? He's just finished a job. Perfectly executed. And who is this man? It's me. Barry? Very interesting, Mr. Thomas. <laughs> Very interesting observation, Mr. Thomas. Uh, thanks for coming in. Expected, but, but that's perfectly fine. Let's take the next one, shall we? Pick any of the remaining cards that make you think of execution, please. Ah, shit. I should have chose that one. Uh, I don't know. The bird? This one. All right. It's like an eagle. Now look at it closely. Take a few moments. Then tell me, do you see an animal? Or an object. Animal. I see. What kind of animal? A bird. An eagle, perhaps. An eagle. Very interesting. A forceful animal. Anything else? It's feeding on something. Feeding? On what? A is carcass. It? The scene is reflected in a pool. I don't of see a carcass. Flowing from the body. It's a vulture. 
feeding on someone else's kill. That's very graphic, Mr. Thomas. Yes, brutal. You asked me, what did I see? Right. Well, that's a very creative interpretation, Mr. Thomas. Uh, I think we've just got time. Oh, there's the, the bird back card. there. <laughs> Please proceed. Uh, this last card should hopefully make you think of prosperity. So I'm an idiot. These are all in the background. <laughs> They're the fucking posters. That's... That looks... That's supposed to be a th bullseye with arrows? And that's the bald eagle. And that's the stack of money. Did I actually get these right? I mean, I don't even know what I see other than money. Well. Huh. Can you elaborate on that? I see a big pile of money earned performing questionable actions. And how do you feel about that? Bending the rules of the game? It's what I do. Very good, Mr. Thomas. That's all we needed to know. Certainly unexpected. I think the results are pretty clear, Mr. Thomas. We don't have the perfect match for the investment banker position. However, you're just the man we need for our accounting department. I have yes! to agree with Kevin here. We need someone a little more cutthroat for the top tier here at the bank. Oh, I can cut throats. To go that I can do that all day. To really dive into character, as it were. But on a positive note, these I lines are so on the nose. In perfectly with the more dry-witted accountants. Mm, great point, Melissa. There's no need to turn this little setback into a complete failure. Someone with your particular set of skills would be perfect for accounting. When can I start? That's the spirit. Tomorrow morning at 8. But you I know might have got an execution opportunity wrong. Day. I don't remember. You've got clearance for the ground floor, first, and second floors. Get to know the space a little. And then we'll see you tomorrow. I can't wait. I'm sure you can see yourself out, Mr. Thomas. See you tomorrow. Okay. What was the intel? I've been hired for accounting. Congratulations, you've been hired as a part of the accounting department in the New York in the New York branch of Milton Fitzpatrick. Your dry wit and get to it attitude is perfect for the bank's needs. Okay. Fuck this mission. <laughs> Fuck it. Um. Yeah, I did all the story challenges. Or story missions. What are the rest of the challenges? Just like simple assassinations? Yep. Push her through the clock. Through the mirror. Poison her drink. Assassinate with her an award. Dump something into ventilation. Escape in the armored truck. <laughs> Be a creep. Open an account. Uh... Oh, I didn't get it all right. Escape using the maintenance hatch. <laughs> Ruin Frank's day. Do you even care? Poison the ventilation. Break the vault with a crowbar. Throw the data core at someone and knock them out. Get fired. Hand over the files. Poison and drink of the banker. And that's it. Um, okay. So I am going to be playing the next one, because I that one took me like an hour. But before I do that, uh, I'll just use now, so I don't want to, <clears throat> just to get it over with. If you don't know, I like to rank stuff, because I've been ranking the missions of all the games. Here's a list for yep, AN2. At number one, we have Miami. Number two, Isle of Sig Isle Scale. Three, Mumbai. Four, Wilton Creek. Five, Santa Fortuna. Six, Hawks Bay. You know what's great about this one? What's this one called? Uh, just New York. It's not great. Definitely six or seven.
uh, see, here's the thing. I don't think this mission was good. The story missions were barely entertaining. That one sucked ass. Where you could have done it in two seconds. Doesn't even matter. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Number seven. <laughs> Mew. New York. It could have been so much better. Talk space only better because it was a tutorial mission. That's all it was. This felt like a beginner's mission. Like, what was this? It was not good. So yeah, number seven. Oh. New York. Okay. And let's uh, jump into the last one. The last resort. This is even like part of the real mission. You can barely make that out. So, this is paradise. If you can afford. Gentlemen, glad to hear you made it out of New York. Where are we? Olivia decrypted the data 47 recovered from the bank. We isolated three transactions from Providence partner accounts. All made out to Haven, a small corporation operating out of the Maldives. And what does Haven do? To the public, they specialize in reputation management for the rich and famous. The real money, however, comes from the covert reconstruction of identities for wealthy criminals. They make people disappear. The partners are using Haven. So I think these are DLC missions identities. for levels. Yes. Olivia's been attempting to hack the Haven servers, but the owners of Haven are manually resetting the access keys every 10 hours. That, unfortunately, makes them targets. Haven Island is a tro tropical paradise. This is like a, it's a commercial footage courtesy of Haven Resort as a combined headquarters and client entertainment center. Current and potential clients are ferried to the island and treated to the very best the Maldives have to offer. Michelin star chefs, a full massage spa, private huts, exercise facilities, and all the comforts of a luxury island resort are made available to them. 47, we'll be sending you in as a potential new client. We've put together a convincing cover story. You're Mr. Reaper. Yes. A thief for hire, looking to disappear for a while. Your mission on the island is simple. You need to eliminate the three owners of Haven. Tyson Williams, founder and rumored tyrannical CEO of Haven. Ludmilla Vitrova, a former confidence artist hired by Williams to serve as a client recruiter and handler. And Stephen Bradley, technical wizard and the brains behind Haven's proprietary software platform. Coding and blocking. The owner's Luckily, gone. Olivia would be able to penetrate the Haven servers long enough for her to secure the new partner identities. I've uploaded all the information we have on the island and the three targets. Best of luck, gentlemen. Hmm. I don't rely on luck. Well, a little would. Eliminate Tyson, Bujamalia, and Steven. Okay, I didn't know these were even DLC missions. I thought they were part of the game. Okay. Uh, it's five mission stories. Swap this for a lockpick. And let's head in. Steven is super oily and sweaty. Bring that boy inside. This so much reminds me of uh, Dead Island. The Haven Island staff is ready to receive you under your assumed identity as Tobias Reaper, a professional thief looking to retire from a life of crime. Ludmilla Vitrova 
can be found in the public sections of the island, primarily tending to client needs. Stephen Bradley alternates between looking after a strict training regimen and working on a small private island. While Tyson Williams roams his large villa estate at the back of the island. Where are all those markings on the guy? Is it like cigar this burns? Is it, 47. Eliminating the three owners of Haven should buy Miss Hall the time needed to do a full penetration and retrieval of the Providence partner data. Best of luck, 47. Thanks, Diana. Do I have any luggage? Is that mine? 41 locations? Okay, much bigger than... Uh... Wow, very big and lots of floors. Is that all over there? Yeah. I got some over here, too. Wait. No? I don't think that... Is that underground? No, there's no stairs that go down. Okay. Guess I'll uh, check in. Oh, hello. That is Ludmilla Vitrova, English-born former confidence artist of Russian descent and current client handler for Hang on, someone's talking to my ear. Careful with this one, 47. Okay. Thank you. Are you one of the owners? Yes, indeed. I'm Ludmila Vitrova, co-owner of Haven, and your gracious host for this day. I suspect we'll be seeing more of each other today. Oh, I'm sure of that, Miss Vitrova. Wonderful. Your late booking has me intrigued. In the meantime, our staff will take good care of your needs. Thank you, Miss Petrova. Come find me when you're ready, Mr. Reaper. I think we have lots to talk about. If you haven't been to your like hut what? yet, I highly recommend it. There's a letter there for you, which you may find interesting. Thank okay. you, Miss Petrova. I was just about to check in. Uh, do I have to check in? Is that how this works? I assume so. I'll kill you later. How do you know me? Please collect your key to the private hut in the welcome center. Okay. okay enjoy your stay. Thank you. Mr. Hello. Reaper, welcome to Haven. Here is the key for your personal hut. Um, it's the one behind you on the right. Oh, Thank you. And Miss Petrova asked me to tell you that she has left a personal message for you in your hut. <gasps> Can I take a minute? Sir. Can I take one? Come on, they, oh, they got you. Give me a minute. Okay. Uh, so it's that one? Can uh, 47 just stay? Wait, no, that, is that not it? Behind you on the right. You didn't say my right or your right. Oh, I'm here at your service, so if there is anything you need, please <laughs> don't hesitate to ask. Let's see if I can push him. All right, I'm in. Even. Oh, those were at the bank. An ocean of knowledge. What's on TV? I'm good. Alright, got a phone. Swimwear. I already like it. Got a closet. Got an apple. What more do I need? Letter. A note from Ludmilla Vitrova. I wonder what she wants from you, 47. Regardless, it would be a shame to keep her waiting. Okay, I'll go. A t-shirt? Why is there a t-shirt? Then why two blindfolds? It's only me coming. Oh, look at those abs. Miss Petrova, it's okay. Tobias Reaper. Oh, she's I right there. Your note. Excellent. I reviewed your file prior to your arrival and have found it very intriguing. You can only hear that in my right ear. If you're interested, you can find me over at the bank. I'll keep it in mind. Wonderful. I hope to see you there. Okay. 
Meet here at the restaurant as Mr. Reaper. Why is that illegal? It was in my bathroom. Oh, can I go water skiing? <laughs> Wait, why can I... What can I do here? Can I just patrol the beach? No, yeah, you could. Okay, let's uh, go meet her. See, this place is nice. They don't have... They, they aren't frisking you immediately. They have open arms. They're all welcome. Friendly. This is what I'm talking about. Hopefully no one frisks me. <laughs> Cuban night. Dance, dine, drink. Salsa dancing. Cuban cuisine. Cocktails. Is it Wednesday? It technically is Wednesday today right now. Very early Wednesday. Hello. Mr. Reaper. Hello, sir. So good to see you. You mentioned an offer. Yes. It's a little embarrassing, but we've had an incident. A theft. The thief is an employee here. A person working in Mr. Williams's villa at the other end today, of the sir. island. Shut up. What was stolen? A USB drive containing some sensitive information. Personal information which I would rather not fall into the hands of others. So, my offer is this. Obtain the USB drive from the thief without alerting anyone at the villa. The thief is likely still there. I can't get you inside, so you'll have to use that particular skill set of yours to gain access. Do that. And I'll convince Mr. Williams to give you a 50% discount on our service fee. That's a million dollars, Mr. Reaper. Holy shit, that's expense. The information must be valuable. Mostly to me. 50% off. Cool, like a few hundred off? A million dollars. What? Very well. I'll call you. Okay, infiltrate the villa. Probably should have sat down for that, but oh well. Okay, uh, let me save it here. Ah, oh, can you feel the sand in your toes? Is he leaving footprints? He is. <laughs> it's funny how someone is actually telling you, use that skill set of yours to do this for me. Okay. Private property, no trespassing. I'm trespassing. I thought that was like a sentry gun. Oh. Okay, it doesn't matter. Probably don't want to see me get in there though. Get open this. Oh wait. Duh. Anyone found anything on the security tapes yet? My ass on the line here, you got it? Whoever stole Mr. Williams' USB key had access to the villa, so it must be somebody Nothing yet. I've told the others this is a top priority, sir. Damn it. Review the tape, find the perp, and get me that USB. Isn't it the same mission? More importantly, I get to keep my job. That's clearly a thief in paradise. Someone stole a USB from Tyson Williams, and now the entire security squad is looking for it. Perhaps you should look closer at those security tapes, 47. I mean, aren't these technically the same thing? I'll keep following that for now. But, uh... But yeah, no shit. Like, they haven't searched you or anything. It's a haven for criminals. Duh. Can I get this guy over here? Uh... Really? Didn't hear that? There you go. We 
might have a possible disturbance. I'm moving to investigate. We'll keep you posted. Hopefully you're on in the camera's line of sight. Okay, all good. Uh, Razor, do you have something else? Villa key. Gone. Okay. Uh, where are the downstairs stairs? I could climb that. I have to sneeze. Do I? I don't know. Oh, hidden door. Mm -hmm. Good day. There. Oh. Is there another way to get down? Uh. Are you a chemist? No, no, shit! Fuck! Uh, is there another way down? Uh, missed my golden opportunity there. I just had to. That was a gunshot. I want to see if that uh, chemist had a key card. Hang on. No, stop. 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 Every. You couldn't wait. You couldn't give me two seconds. Uh. No, I'll go back there. I was thinking about going farther back so I can easily get down there, but. Yeah, I'll find a way. That was just too easy. <laughs> Should I just follow the chemist guy? He's probably bound to go back down, but who knows how long that will take. Coconut. He just phased through the rope. Okay, cool. He's going back. It was a good timing. I won't choke him out until he gets in there. Just because I don't know if he has a key card on him or not. He does. I think. What was that? I'm allowed down here? Okay. Why are you by yourself? He did have a keycard, okay. Oh, he's tech crew. I thought he was like a chemist, like Walter White. So I can mark it. Connector Conspiracy. Uh. Oh. Whoa. What is that? Is that a jellyfish or is that Haven? It's like a jellyfish. I'm surprised I'm allowed down here. Wait, what? Who's the thief? Hello, it was her. Oh, is there something in here? Uh, 
So like poison. I'm gonna have to take this guy out. Uh. Looking good today, sir. Thank you. Listen, I'm sorry about this. But it killed you. But you're a nice. You complimented my look. You get to live. Now there's a, two halves of a coconut on the ground. It's weird they didn't make the lockpick, or they don't make it like a for sure thing you bring in with you. It's always the fiber wire, coin, and gun. Lockpick's like the most useful item. Okay. So how does this affect the other story mission? Ah, uh, you could bring it to one or the other. Oh wait, was that hers? That dumb bitch. Okay, just so uh, I don't do all that again, I'm just going to save it. Number five. I'll continue to bring it to Vitora. Then I'll load back and just give it to the other guy. Wait, what? Oh. Escape hatch. Really? Did I need that? <laughs> Did I need the extra three inches? I want my outfit back, though. I gotta get back. Oh, I am in there. I thought I spawned outside the villa. Has anyone found anything on the security tapes yet? I found the USB, but I'm not giving it to you, suckers. Alright. Back in my beach, guys. And I'm going back. What is this? A shelter? Why is that blocked off? Contact. I like how they have free phones everywhere. Is that her? Miss Vitrover, I've acquired the item you wanted. Wonderful. I knew you were the right individual. I could feel it the moment I laid my eyes on you. Should we meet? Okay. Announce your arrival at the spa. Is she already at that spa? Oh wow, they actually have an actual map of the place. Spa. Where? Why do you not have a UR here? 47 has arrived. Double bookings like yesterday with Portman and Mr. Bradley. I'm still trying to sort out that mess. Oh, yes, yes, Miss Vitrova. Again, very sorry about that. Hmm. Hello? I'm Mr. Reaper. I have an appointment. Ah, yes, Mr. Reaper. You can go right in. Miss Vitrova is waiting for you inside. Apparently, there's a challenge to get 11 of those pamphlets. Ah, Mr. Reaper. So good to see you again. I was standing right behind you. Hey, please. Well. Okay. Let's see where this ends, shall we? Hello. Bow. You, leave us. Oh, I wanted to get a massage. Do you want me to give you a massage? Oh, you have the item no. with you. Can I have it, please? There you go. There you are. Oh. Thank you so much, Mr. Reaper. Actually, I could probably kill her, get it back, and give it to, how much this means to Tyson. Me, Mr. Reaper. 
I'm afraid things aren't quite as serene here as they may seem on the surface. I don't want to dump you in here. I just dump you over the edge. Sorry. Tyson, Mr. Williams. He's not well. That might lo that's probably going to lose time. the USB. We oh well. We together, but his illness. I couldn't take it anymore. I don't know why I'm telling you this. I could probably just subdue her and then knock her out or push her over. I think he asked that girl to steal my information because he wants to I don't know. Punish me? Kill me? Who knows anymore? Sounds hard. You have no idea. I, I don't care about your sob story. Give me the USB Two back. Targets remaining. See ya. Good work, 47. Ludmilla Vitrova has been permanently retired. USB stick. Even Villa key. That's oh, it. I guess I'll do the mission, right? Then break? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, back to the villa. Take out Tyson. Where did I leave my outfit? It's in the bushes? Jesus, this guy's saying the same line over and over again. I found it. I'll give it to him. Oh, it's Tech I can tell what that person was. Said it had likely left some permanent side effects. How do I get in there? Okay, here we go. Oh, I have a key. Damn it, he's leaving. Mr. Williams. Mr. Williams, I understand you Don't get in the bathtub with the ducky yet. Can't even face me, huh? My USB drive. Finally, some good news. You can't wear uh and the pants. Taken care of. That is Tyson uh, Williams, I like CEO of Haley, a reputed like paranoid tyrant. Williams is known for his bad temper and heavy-handedness. Where you, where you going? You're not allowed to follow. Were you the sheriff? You okay with this? There's a guy sleeping on the job. I don't know if he's on the break or what, but still. Knock, knock. Ooh, uh, don't look up. Oh, we're going in the secret room. Yeah, keep it real. Yeah. Oh god, I almost picked that up. It's been a while. Access to William's secret office. Good place for a one-on-one, -on -one, 47. Well, almost. You could easily take them both out, but all right. That's that. I'll wire a handsome reward to your personal account, my friend. Or maybe you know what? I've a better idea. Well, Mike, I guess at least one person in my security detail isn't a complete failure. This man just brought me my stolen item. You got anything to say for yourself? I, uh, I guess he got lucky. lucky. Suck shit, Mike. Lucky? You 
Did I get a promotion? I guess she just got promoted a personal bodyguard. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Williams. Now Mike's been getting on my nerves for months now. The man's got no sense of personal space, you know? You have to sit like that? <laughs> promotion is a once in a lifetime opportunity for you. Make the most of it. Rest assured, Mr. Williams. I will. Good man. Your new outfit's in that locker behind you. I'm just going to do some work in here for a while. Alone. Make sure nobody comes in. Yes, sir, Mr. Williams. Okay. I'm in charge now. Bodyguard. It's in here. Ooh, lethal poison. And I can even open this. How can I do that? Ow. Oh. Okay, let's do this. And... Barber. Thanks for the job. Tyson Williams eliminated. Excellent work, 47. Uh, Just one more target to go. I don't even have anywhere to put you. No one's gonna come in here. And I'm a bodyguard, that's awesome. Does this show me anything? Probably would if he was still alive. Probably be doing something. Alright, uh, Skysers. I have the USB again. <laughs> There's gotta be a mission with the other guy, right? Alright, I'm the bodyguard now. Oh, you're listening to me, alright? Hey, how you doing, sir? Should I just go kill the other guy? Where even is he? He's not that far. Yeah, I went to not working for that guy to instantly being his bodyguard in like 10 minutes. It's amazing what you can do if you really try. Yeah, this is a good disguise. Almost no one recognizes me. Except a couple. Storm's coming. Is that just if you go over here? Or is that always happening? Oh, oh, whoa, 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 I'm sorry, what happened? You didn't even give me a chance. Uh. That was killing fast. I don't want to play this mouse and, or cat and mouse game. The waiting game, I guess? Tyson Williams Thanks for the job. Excellent work, 47. Just one more target to go. Maybe I can go there in this outfit. Because that's what they're wearing. Or maybe they know exactly. I'm mean, gonna guess he has like his own little army over there, like separate from everyone else. Was it? Oh, poison flowers. All right, next time I should really read the signs. 
Can I come in now? And oh, there he is. That is Stephen Bradley, notorious hacker, chief programmer at Haven, and rumored to be quite reckless in his behavior. Is there a mission story anywhere around here? Now let's take a quick look. Private Island. Oh, hello, chef. Serve tiki drinks. Who are you, his friend? Oh, they had the challenge all the way back here? I didn't know that. That storm is a comet. No one even notices the guy's knocked out. They're gonna kill this guy. Just do it fast. You got this. That's all we need to do from here. Miss Hall should be able to extract the information needed from the Haven servers. Good work, 47. Alright, cool. So, that's Stephen Bradley taken care of. Well done. Do you have a key anywhere? For that thing? Jet ski key? Nope. Okay, uh, time to leave. <laughs> it's another exit over there. What is locked off? Can I borrow that? Don't worry, he's dead. Why is this locked? Snorkel instructor. Oh, there's an exit over there. Damn it. Well, that was a better mission than, uh, New York. Also, has the storm always been coming? Or is that, like, the more targets you kill, the more storm there is? I don't know. Alright. That's it. That's all the missions. We're gonna go back and do, uh, the other storm missions. How's that guy standing in the ocean? Island and chill? <laughs> Completed the last resort. But yeah, that, uh, the banana thing. I thought that was in... They brought that in Hitman 3. I guess they... Thought of it for, like, this DLC then... Brought into, like, the main game. There. Stash. A saber. Tool. Okay. The last cutscene. time in paradise productive right we should hear from the others soon we're in whatever your robot did back on the island it worked let's see well, i just realized yeah, uh, here we are. all the cutscenes in the main game were like yeah right here still but... images no wait a minute Something these are all like full animation see here all those controlling shares those are basically the backbone of the providence empire but they're not going to the new partner identities. What do you mean? I mean, they're allocated to someone else. Everything is. The partners are, are left with no real control. Who is Arthur Edwards? The Constant. 
He's gone. He played us like a fiddle. Message from Olivia. Everything's going to plan. We know where the partners are. We have our targets. You're almost there, old friend. Feels... good, doesn't it? And then this leads into three. We should head out before the storm hits. Time to fulfill our purpose, 47. To take them all down. first two missions of three, you take down the partners. Don't remember how the story fits in after that, though. Okay. Uh, let's replay it so I can do the last three story missions. Yep. Deep Breath, Shape Changer, Water Horse. Okay. Yeah, bring me in the house. Just go as is. Nice, just chillaxing. Okay, uh, take a deep breath. I'm not allowed over there. Pamela, it's me. Hello. You're never gonna guess where I am. Yes, nice golden suit. Did. I'm here now. It's amazing. He's apparently gotta do his doctor thing here. Meet up with some people. Damn, wearing my shoes. Williams over at this big villa on the other end of the island. On the other end of the. Tyson Williams has summoned a doctor to the island. He must be feeling under the weather. You have some experience with pain relief, 47. Maybe you could be of assistance? Okay, disguise yourself as the doctor. Oh, he's up here. This is wanted, right? We're trespassing? Yeah. Don't turn around. Gus, didn't they clean this place at all? Oh, strange. Stethoscope. Lady, you really shouldn't have walked in here. I'm a professional hitman if he didn't notice. God, this place is a pigsty. Yeah, it is. Oh. Okay, uh, put you in here. Take another stethoscope. Why not? Get escorted to William's room. Dr. Reaper. Yeah, that's far. Why the cut sleeves on the lab coat? What's the point of that? I probably can't have any guns, so I'll drop them off right here.
Hello. You gonna touch me? The doctor, right? Mr. Williams is expecting you. I thought this was a safe place. Sorry, I gotta, I gotta frisk you first. I'm afraid. At least you're sorry about it. Let me just pad you down here. You gonna take this cigarette off my ear too? Right, that's it. Keep moving, please. Okay. He has a butler? I'm the doctor. Yes, well, I guessed as much. Follow me to Mr. Williams's room, please. And don't touch anything. Touch. We're in the house today. Working really hard, I can see. Okay, I'm in. Excellent, 47. I hope you can offer the man some assistance. Ah. Uh, oh, it's not in here. It's in, uh... It's in his thing downstairs. Secret room. Hello. Nothing else? Dr. Singh is tired. Long night. He asked me to fill in. I knew I shouldn't have allowed him to bring that mistress of his here. I'm running a bad fever here, Doc. Burning up. I can't go outside. I can hardly stay inside. It started about ten days ago. Singh gave me those pills over there, but they aren't helping. They just give me a migraine. I think I need something stronger here, Doc. Remove your robe, please. I want to check. Uh -huh. I don't need to see more of this guy. No, I thought he was going in the bed. S sexy. Can I take the rope? What are these markings all over him? Before medical examination. So you're running a fever, Mr. Williams? Yeah, like I said. More than a week now, but the worst thing is the headache. Bad migraine, Doc. The light therapy doesn't help me a lot. What can you do for me? Probably should have taken him out. Let's have a quick look at you before we do anything <laughs> drastic, Mr. Williams. Fine, fine. Come, please. Tell it to me straight, Doc. You have two hours to live. Bad. I got some very serious business More like to attend to. 20 minutes, really actually. Eh, I'll make it two minutes. Shit. We'll be done soon. Turn around for me. <laughs> you too, Butler. Oh, hell. Can't you do anything to strangle this cough, Doc? I have a few <laughs> ideas, Mr. Williams. Tyson Williams eliminated. Excellent work, 47. Oh, this guy didn't even realize. Two targets remaining. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Don't look. Can what? Oh, it can be the butler. Alright. Medical examination's done. Uh, what's next? Oh, we can still do them. Nice. So, by the sounds of it, Miss Feltrova is very keen on getting Jason Portman, former CEO of Quantum Leap, and current CEO of Much, Much Talk, out of his hut. I wonder why. Told you. You'd have uh, two minutes to live. I am a professional medical doctor, as of five minutes ago. Is 
This is a big island. Is this is that? I'm gonna guess so. I should probably sneak in actually. Does Jason want the doctor? Hang on. Stacy's busy. Wait, what? Former CEO of Quantum Leap and current CEO of Microsoft, Who saw it? The disreputed social media network currently involved in a user data scandal. Why is he here, 47? Turtle Hut. Fuck. Uh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> How is that a story mission? Lady, protect. Oh, no, you're a dude. Protect me. Body shield. You'll never take me alive. Hide. Protect me, ball. Protect me. So I don't know how that was really a story mission, but whatever. Uh. That should attract. See it. Let's just see the last one. And I guess it has to do with Stephen Bradley. Yeah, tracked. I don't know how it would have worked, but man, whatever. Kleptomaniac? What? Does that mean to like unlock all your doors? No? Mr. Reaper. Sorry, not talking to you. Bye. I thought that was the big hero six icon in the middle. <laughs> What happened out there? He's Haven's chief software oh yeah, so there's no storm. He almost killed us. The boat is still out there in the water, sunk. I could have been in there. And all I guess the storm comes the more you eliminate targets. What an absolute ass. Yeah, he's not. So Stephen Bradley likes to go on water scooters, but is unable to go out because the scuba instructor confiscated his keys. Shame. Those things are very accident prone. Going out again, okay. The Retrieve the water. Er, ugh. Retrieve the water scooter keys. Scuba instructor. Scuba Steve! Get over here. Are you really walking into the forest? It'd be great if this guy wasn't looking. Uh, nothing I can even throw. Damn it. I need to find something I could toss. Oh, block hole. If I need a coconut. <laughs> uh... I think I just need the keys. I don't know if I need to get his whole outfit.
oil leak. What the hell are you doing, man? Uh, I need something I can toss. Another pamphlet. Oh, it's a Haven guys. I thought that was, thought was at the massage parlor. Is there nothing I can take? I'm glad we don't have to talk to that Petrova woman. Give me those. Anymore. I can't Did even toss them. She was last night? Portman could hardly get away from her. Oh, they got a gym here? Personal trainer. Here's something. <laughs> Just put that in my pocket. Oh, now there's no one here. Oh, there he is. All right, just to reiterate, water treaters are not toys. They're dangerous as hell. They'll maybe do something horrible, but they'll fall off the barrier. Just in case. Don't chase marine animals. Don't go far out. Can I just take this suit? Looks like my size. Uh, can you all just leave? I'm considering just shooting him and just dragging him in there. And I could just kill everyone here. We'll just try again. Three. Oxygen seems to be working now. Okay, let me get rid of this guy. Oh, really? What the hell was that? Uh huh. Maybe it was just a poltergeist. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Ghostbusters. Well, shit. What are you doing? Let go right now. Hey, man. Ah! Ah! No, no, no. Ah! Quickly, let's go. Well, that kind of worked out. Wait, where are the keys? Key maker. I don't know, they found it on Conscience Girl. Am I allowed? I have his keys. Sorry, sir, I got orders. Can't let you through. Sorry for the inconvenience. All right, I'll go around. What do you care? As long as I'm giving him his keys. Wait, what? All right. Hey, oh. Mr. Bradley, are these yours? Dude, I've been looking everywhere for those. You just made my day. I am going to tear the sea a new one. Thanks, buddy. My pleasure. All right. Let's see how well Mr. Bradley controls that water scooter of his. I mean, there's probably a way to sabotage it. Also, maybe he'll just fuck it up. I'm gonna assume it's this one. I 
Oh, install remote explosive. It is a tight suit. I mean, is it going to crash somehow? Or is it just expecting me to... blow him up? Jesus, man. Man, that's invigorating. Bring it on! Yeah, I was expecting an explosive. Okay. Two targets remaining. Got him. So, that's Stephen Bradley taken care of. Well done. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's it. For now, at least. There still is more to do. There are the Sniper Assassin Nations missions. That's it for the campaign of Hitman 2. Plus the DLC. But also, these were introduced with Hitman 2. So I'll probably do those at some point. But for now, that's it. That's it for Hitman 2. Uh, glad I finally got the whole Hitman story. I do want to, now that I know everything that happened, I do want to see the cinematics again. But before that, one more thing that we have to rank. Where Haven? Is that what it was called? Haven Island. Um... New York is going to move down. Hawks Bay is going to move down. Santa Fortuna going to move down. Whittleton Creek. Um, kind of similar... They're kind of similar, like, with, like, the challenges and stuff. I kind of like the island resort better. I, I didn't even look at the challenges, really. Uh, the massage kill. Shooting him through a projector canvas. Chandelier. A trapdoor accident. Bench press. Explosive. Kitchen. The sniper shot while he's on the scooter. All with poison. A jacuzzi accident. There's a lot of stuff here. Uh, obtain a copy of the secret Navy report. Sir, redacted. Chef, fuck, cock. <laughs> I was to say fuck tails, cocktails. Uh, hidden treasure. Boat captain. Sleep with the. Wait, did I not do that? I kicked the guy in there. Hi, Steven. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's escalation. Okay. Um. I'll put it in number four. Wilton Creek was fun. I really think it should have been like the tutorial beginner level. But Haven, Haven Island, I think it's a better setting location. And that's it for the Hitman 2 rankings. Number one, Miami. Number two, Isle of Scale. Three, Mumbai. Four, Haven Island. Five, Wilton Creek. Six, Santa Fortuna. Seven, Hawks Bay. And eight, New York.
yeah, New York had had so much potential. I would have enjoyed it more if they had way more missions, like some like actually starting like a bank heist with the people in the bathroom. If like they added like alleyways around the bank, would have been cool. Just like give it a bit more. But um, yeah, I do want to do one more thing or a couple more things. But first, I want to go back and watch the cutscenes from Hitman Three just so I get the full story. That's so far. I'll watch the briefings and the and the cutscenes. Look closer. In the shadows. Behind the everyday world. Beyond the headlines and the seats of power. A hidden hand. A kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away, to do the unthinkable, the unforgivable, and it never gave us a second thought until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back, me and 47. Much has been lost, but we are closer than ever. We trapped the Constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learnt the names of its three partners. In their downfall, we lay the past to rest. And, just maybe, look towards the future. 37. It's time. I will say, this was the coolest opening, though. You immediately parachuting out into a building. Ever considered having a co-op with 47 and Gray? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirmed target locations over. Diana, what's the status? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle is rushing to contain the damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays the same. Your destination is the Scepter, the world's tallest building where the partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar Al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth-generation old money. His family made its fortune in real estate and banking, and were at one point the chief landowners in New York. Carl Ingram is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War, and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil, coal, and steel. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming so Mr. Gray will infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Happy hunting.
Okay, actually, I'm going to keep watching these, but for people watching later on YouTube, I am going to pause it just so you don't have to sit through it all. Uh, if you want to watch it all, click, click link in the bottom and it'll bring you to the... It'll bring you to the full stream I did and it'll be playing there. So I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, just got done watching all the cinematics and stuff. So uh, I am ready to do this. Uh, before I do the major overhaul, all missions ranked. Let's just get this quickly out of the way. The Hitman 2 game ranking as it is. It's the same as the other ones, 8 out of 10. Design, design was good. I don't know what could have been better, but I feel like it's, a, it's the same. Half the levels were good, half the levels were eh. If all of them were bangers, then sure, 2 out of 2. The graphics were decent, really good. I don't know what could have been missing, but I don't feel like it was the best ever. Gameplay, that's all there is to the game. It's fun killing people, finding different ways to kill people. Doing different challenges, mission stories, whatever. The story, the story is the same. I'm never, I'm not in love with the story. Uh, parts of it are confusing, and yeah, the story is not the main part of the game. The main part is killing people. Worth the money. You can replay it over and over again. Do all the challenges. It's made for replayability. Not really any bugs, so yeah, 2 out of 2. Funness, I have a fun time playing this game, going back, doing all the challenges. And yeah, so it's 2 out of 2, so 8 out of 10 total. And now really quickly... Switch over to... The series rank. At number 1, Hitman 3. Number 2, Hitman. This is gonna be easy. At number... Two, Hitman 2. And number three, Hitman. It's a story told all throughout each game, improving upon the last. And yeah. Really, it's not about the story or the levels, because each game has good and bad levels. It's about, like, the stuff they add to each one. And two, they added, they tried to experiment a bit more. They added sniper assassins. They... It's a bit hard to tell what they added because I don't really remember. But they also... I'm playing on Hitman 3, 1 and 2, so... It's kind of confusing what they added, but I'm sure they added a bunch more. Hitman 3, they had stuff like shortcuts. And a bunch of other stuff I'm just not remembering right now. But they added stuff. So, yeah. At number 1, Hitman 3. Number 2, Hitman 2. Number 3, Hitman. At some point, I do want to go back and play the other Hitman games like Absolution and Blood Money, all those, to get the full story. So I think they're connected and rank them on this list. But now, uh, the one we've been waiting for the Hitman levels ranking. This is going to take a while. <laughs> uh, okay, I need to pull up reference of what I did for two for yeah for the two levels so last last on two was new york is that right this is gonna look confusing for a sec but just trust me yeah two was uh the last on two was new york i definitely think the mountains were the worst level because they Definitely do not feel like a Hitman level. So the mountains will go there. Uh, Colorado versus New York. Colorado was just very boring. So yep, Colorado. Marrakesh versus New York. I really did not like Marrakesh. And then 18, I'll do New York. And 17. Uh, New York versus Hawks Bay.
Or no, not Hawks Bay versus ICF Sully, both the uh, tutorial levels. <laughs> Very iconic. Uh. Put ICA at 16. And Fox Bay at 17. I feel like, uh. Come on. The ICA was a better tutorial level, because it obviously looked like one. It was like teaching you how to play while showing what Hitman can do in like a cardboard world. Fox Bay. Uh, there should, there should have been a different tutorial level. Like, what I keep saying, Wilton Creek should have been the tutorial level. Uh, Bangkok versus Santa Fortuna. Uh, Santa Fortuna, I didn't like as much. I had some okay side missions and stuff. Why doesn't that reach? Uh, Sant Santa. <laughs> Santa Fort. Santa Fortuna. Okay. Uh. Bangkok. Wait, what was after Fortuna? Next Bay. Fortuna. Wilton Creek. Bangkok will go at 14. Dubai versus Whittleton. Hmm. Dubai Devon looked a lot cooler. Whittleton. Whittleton. Next was... Haven? Why do I keep losing this? Where is it? Yeah, Whittleton, then Haven. Dubai at 12. So, Chongqing versus Haven. Hey, uh... I like the setting of Haven more than Chongqing. Yep, what just happened? <laughs> Chongqing. Mendoza versus Haven. I'll go Haven. And then... Mumbai? How many spots are left? Three. I got Mumbai, Isle, and then Miami. Okay. Um, Mumbai versus Mendoza. Look at Mumbai. I kind of like the castle vineyard, vineyard more than the streets of Mumbai, with like acting and gangs and shit. Uh, Mumbai versus Isle. I really like Isle. I love the castle theme setting. So what was like going on there? Like the initiation of the, like, the Ark Society. So Mendoza. Number eight. God, thank God we're only in one tab now. Okay. Uh, Paris. It's below it. Dartmoor. Ooh, this is where it gets tough. Um, <laughs> really funny. Two from each level is in the top six. Um, Highland Castle with weird society versus. Murder Mystery Mansion. Uh, 
Uh, I'll put Domar below Isle. I don't think it's better than Akaido. All right, last is Miami. Oh, Miami was really good. Um, it's better than Hokkaido. Uh, so. That'd be really cool if one from each was in the top three. Uh, a beautiful racetrack in Miami versus a snowy region that develops that's like a medical facility uh, I need a refresher on Miami's challenges it's been a while since I played uh, do a lot of stuff with the cars The trophies, the androids. Um, the flamingo, <laughs> the Florida man. Okay. I'll put Hokkaido at number four, just because I think Miami is much more beautiful, but it's not going any higher. Oh, that was the toughest ranking I've done. The longest one, too. Is that all of them? Let me make sure. We got ICA, Paris, Sapienza, Sapienza, Marrakesh, Bank. Wait, no, there's 21. None of them copy? No. No, that's it. We're all good. This is my list for the Hitman Trilogy levels ranked. Number one, Berlin. Two, Sapenzi Sapienza. Three, Miami. Four, Hokkaido. Five, Isle of Scale. Six, Dartmoor. Seven, Paris. Eight, Mendoza. Nine, Mumbai. Ten, Haven. Eleven, Chongqing. 12 to buy, 13 Wilton Creek, 14 Bangkok, 15 Santa Fortuna, 16 ICA facility, 17 Hawks Bay, 18 New York, 19 Marrakesh, 20 Colorado, 21 Capitania Mountains. My god, what a, what a trilogy. Good games. Okay, so yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it for all the rankings. Should I rank his suits? <laughs> no, I'm just done. Okay, I'm done. Okay, that's it with the rankings all done. What else do we have to look forward to? Hitman 2, I still want to do the Sniper Assassins. Hitman 1, I want to go back and do like these secondary missions. Because this was like the DLC. They had new stuff in the missions already. The Hulk, uh, Hitman 2, they just added two whole new levels. Pretty sure level and the good level. And there is DLC coming out right now for Hitman 3. They have the Seven Deadly Sins. Right now they have Greed and Illumination. So I'll have to get it. And there's also the Berlin Easter Egg Hunt. Oh, it's an Escalation? I thought it was like something else. I don't know what I was thinking, but it's still, we'll check that out. It's around for another 12 days, I think. And then the collector, newest elusive target comes in about a week. And there's still some featured uh, escalation contracts I might check out. Oh, there's still so much in this game. 
But that's going to do it for this video. So thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Uh, be sure to subscribe and share as well. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.